Hi everyone. So today is I'm going to talk about the uh, machine learning uh, KNN, which stands for K nearest neighbor. So okay, let's begin. So I'm going to show you an example of the uh, Jupyter notebook. So you can basically download the Anaconda Navigator, and then you can just launch it uh, directly from here. Or you could ins install it separately, and then you go to command line, and then just type uh, Jupyter Notebook, and it will be able to run it on your computer. So I have this uh, little example of uh, KNN, which is more like a basic algorithm for machine learning. Uh, it's basically for the classification so basically so I'm gonna start from here so I'm importing the pandas so I could read my data set and then do some data science stuff so first you could you could run one by one okay and then if you want to add some uh, one more code here you could just uh, click the plus button or if you want to cut it out you could just uh, click the scissor okay the second uh, you want to see if your data is already loaded or not, right? So you could see like uh, just like two rows or three rows of your data, like this. df dot hat. So you uh, first install your CSV file into df using pandas pd, and then you want to see the first three uh, rows of the data. So I have here, and then. Uh, let's say you want to see how many rows and columns are there okay so you have like 699 rows and 11 columns as you can see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 okay so this is this is cool if you want to see the all the uh, like count mean standard deviation mean max so this is we using the breast cancer data set from the UCI machine learning data set so which has a uh, the data set contains some of this uh, like a missing data which is uh, replaced with the question mark so you can replace it with minus this is this and then you can drop the ID we don't it's not uh, useful for the training and then uh, for the uh, also the class because we are classif uh, classifying based on class right so you can drop it first and you can see the data after you drop the classes and the ID and this is the y value so this is the main fun part so uh, you can use the psych, uh, scikit-learn from scikit-learn you can import train test split first you have to split it uh, based on 20% uh, of the test set 80% uh, so here what I'm doing is 20% uh, test 70% train and the 10% for valid validation okay that's cool and then classifier this is the uh, method you could use so I'm choosing K as an N the K which is a K nearest neighbor and neighbors 7 so there's many distant metric you could use so here I'm using the Euclidean there's other like uh, uh, Manhattan or other distance of course you have to fit it and then you can predict and if you want to print out whether it's the benign or malignant after the prediction and you can see the accuracy using this function and this is basically if you want to print out the basic report